Hey guys, it's Jeff here. Welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. In the last episode, we killed one of the Terran Tartex and uh, found the uh, the blade that we're going to give back to Freya so he can lead his people, hopefully. Um, but we, we've also found these dead Wookiees here. And uh, I think this is where the Mandalorians like to attack. Um, it's been said that we need to remove our weapons first before we can draw them out, so I guess we're going to do that. Um, I don't really like putting my weapons away. Uh, let's just go none. Okay, uh, let's go none. And Bastler as well. Hopefully we don't need to remove uh, everything. Um, we did find the Verpine headband. Oh, sorry, the circlet of Saresh in the last episode. Um, which does give us will... Uh, uh, wisdom, I should say. Uh, plus five. Um, okay, let's do that. Let's use the, the circlet of Saresh for wisdom plus five. Uh, let's have a look at that anyway. Wisdom plus five. Let's have a look and see how that... Uh, wisdom 17. The bonus plus three. Okay, we'll see how that goes. Um, okay, we've removed all of our... weapons. We're not being attacked the moment. Aha. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Is there only three of them? Uh, Mandalorian. They're, they're decked out in armor. Uh, this guy's taking a little bit of damage. I guess we should focus on him first of all. Um, okay, we need to go back and get our weapons back now. Uh... 5 to 19. Are these lightsabers all the same? They kind of are. I like this kind of dark purple one. Let's use that as one of them. And we're going to use... The longsword is pretty good as well. It does quite a bit of damage. Um, the same with the, the vibro sword. Uh, let's use the green, the purple and the green there. If we use the short lightsaber, we do get the extra bonus, but uh, it does a little bit less damage. Let's use, yeah, two two big lightsabers there for Jazra. Now, I was thinking about giving this guy um, some, uh, some pistols instead, because he's not really that good against uh, using... Let's have a look. 2 to 13 damage. Well, it's not bad. It's not bad, I guess. 3 to 17. Yeah, I guess we'll give him the lightsabers. Or even a double-bladed lightsaber. He's not that skilled at using it, though. Actually, that's uh, Bastila's double-bladed lightsaber. Or is Bastila the red one? I can't remember now. No, Bastila is the yellow one. That's got the bonuses there. Um, okay, let's give him the... Hmm. So the pistols don't really do that much damage. And we are in close combat now. So let's give him uh, a lightsaber here. Let's give him a lightsaber, and I'm going to give him, in the other hand, uh, we're going to give him the short lightsaber as well, so he does have... Did that reduce... Oh, that reduced his to hit by quite a bit there. Um, hmm, I don't know if it's worth it. Let's just do it. Let's do it. He's... Yeah, he's not so good at uh, combat. Uh, let's give him the Fortitude plus 3. Uh, we'll give him Energy Shield as well. And... Hmm. That should do. We can give him the Neural Band. Will plus 2. Uh, let's give him the Verpine Headband. That's what Jazra was wearing earlier. Uh, and Strength Gauntlets. Strength Amplifier. Uh, Jazra has the strength gauntlets as well. Um, yeah, we can give him the strength gauntlets there uh, for strength plus one. Uh, so we'll do that. Uh, Bastila needs her double-bladed lightsaber back again. Six to twenty-nine damage. Beautiful. And I think we are good to go. The dueling shield deflects energy sixty damage. Okay, so let's. They've all got short swords. Let's use the dueling shield here, and then take on this guy. 
Um, oh my god, Bastler has taken a lot of damage already. Uh, it's really not good. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to heal. Take on this guy. Can we use the uh, the Force Lightning? Actually, let's heal. Use the Force Lightning. See if that does. See if that works. Um, if not, stun, flurry. I need to keep everyone alive um, to take out these guys. If we can focus on one guy at a time, but I think Jazreel can hopefully deal with this guy. I'm hoping. I'm here. You cannot win. I can't even take this guy out. I can't even hit him once. This is absolutely ridiculous. Um, I think I'm going to have to reload the game because... Yeah, Bastel is down. Did this even work? Did the Force Lightning even, even work at all? Please? Let's... Okay, it does work, which is cool. But uh, this guy has taken a little bit of damage there. I'm going to have to focus... Oh, sorry, this guy has taken a, yeah, a tiny little bit of damage. Jazra is stunned now as well. Uh, let's focus on that guy if I can get him. We're going to have to heal up as well. Um, what? Oh my god, okay. This is a, this is a reload. Oh! Those guys are really tough. Those guys are really, really tough. I don't know how I'm going to deal with them. Um, I guess I'm going to have to take off my um, uh, my weapons again. So let's remove that. Uh, let's remove that. And let's remove that. Okay. Um, hmm. This guy needs something to beef him up. 42 plus 3. Uh, let's give him the energy shield. Let's give him the... The neural band. Uh, he can't use anything there. The, uh, the strength gauntlets as well. Um, actually, Jazra, I swapped her over to the circlet of Sarash for the extra wisdom there, which means I can give this guy the um, the verpine headband for will plus three. Um, I think we're good to go. Merely shield. Okay, she should use that. Let's have a look at what that does. It's only 20 points of slashing damage. Um, hmm. Okay, let's save the game here before we get into this battle again. I think we're going to have to, to, to beef up our defenses somehow. We need... Oh, this is really tough. This is really tough. Uh, adrenal stamina, alacrity. Hyper adrenal alacrity. We've got the hyper strength as well, the battle stimulant. Let's give Bastila the battle stimulant. Uh, Jazra is going to have the uh, the adrenal strength, and he's going to have the adrenal strength as well. Uh, let's head into this battle once more. Okay, we're going to have to focus on a single character. I think if we turn around. Uh, take on this guy as quickly as we can. If everybody just focuses on this guy here, if we take down one, then I think we have a better chance at, at, at winning this battle. Uh, these two guys have got level, level ups as well that I can use. I'm here. Oh god, she took almost complete damage in a single hit. She's down to four vitality. That is ridiculous. In one round of combat, she lost 59 points. That is absolutely crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Let's give her strength. Oh, she's got really high dexterity. Increases, um, hmm. Should we give her constitution for the extra vitality? Let's give her strength for the extra modifier there. Uh, we do get to give her some skills as well. She's only got two points. Um, hmm. Demolitions, stealth, computer use. What is she good at? good at? Awareness? And treat injury. That is pretty much it. So I guess we'll give her awareness and treat injury. Uh, she does get a new power as well. Um, 
This is really tough. This is really tough. Stasis? Oh, I like Stasis, if it can actually work against these guys. I, I'm not sure it's actually... Was she not level 9? Hmm, okay. Effect Mind. Uh, force Resistance. Uh, energy Resistance. Plus one attack. Uh, character level nine. Is she, is she level eight, I think? I guess we could give her force shield. Let's do that. I don't know what else to give her at the moment. Uh, so we're going to accept that. Yeah, she's level eight. Next time we can give her um, the increased night speed for two attacks, I think, per round. Um, so, oh God. I can't believe she took so much damage. Uh, okay, so she's got some things lined up here. I'm still trying to take on this guy and do actually do some damage. Uh, let's do some more of these. Seems to work fairly well. Let's try that. Um, I'm here. Oh, hang on a minute! I didn't give them their weapons back. Oh, damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I cannot believe I didn't give them their weapons back. That is ridiculous. Uh, okay, there we go. And I kind of, I kind of screwed this up already. But let's. I'm wondering why this guy's trying to kick him uh, and not use his his lightsaber. Anyway, uh, let's give him a lightsaber here. Uh, uh, can he not use a lightsaber? What's going on here? Can he not? He can't. He can't seem to select anything. I guess he's in the middle of a combat here. Um, okay, let's wait for him to. Oh, he's doing a force power. Okay. Okay. Now let's let's try and see if we can give him a weapon. Um, I can't believe he was trying to punch and kick them. That's ridiculous. Uh, he's got one last saber there out already, and let's give him another short uh, lightsaber as well. Uh, I'm going to close this. Who needs some help here? Bastila has taken just so much damage. Uh, but we've almost taken down this guy, actually. Uh, if we use Force Shield... What can I do? Oh, damn it. These guys hit so damn hard. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. Bastila has gone down. Um, only took like two rounds to go down that time. Uh, okay, so the cure is probably not worthwhile at the moment. This guy needs to do another force lightning. Okay. This guy, what is this guy doing? I don't know what he's doing. Um, he's just kind of standing there. Uh, Jazra stunned as well. Let's take out this guy if we can. He's just watching. So he hasn't been engaged yet, which is kind of cool. Um, which means we can just focus on... Just focus on taking out these two guys. I'm not even sure what a life support pack is. Uh, she's another one of those. Let's cure. Oh god. Oh god, I'm just... just... <laughs> so tough. Oh my god. Um, Jolie, please do something. He's attacking uh, as well as he can. Jazra's stunned again. Uh, let's use another med pack. We're using so many med packs here. These guys are so tough. Not this again! Never too old for this! Is he actually taking any damage? Uh, okay, let's let's use a couple of grenades here. Let's see what happens. What? Oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! Oh! Never too old for this! 
Force depleted. Oh my god, advanced med pack. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> These guys are so tough. We need Basila here. Uh, I think I've kind of screwed it up now, but... Uh, I may have to try this again. Uh, bring Bastila out, because I just cannot, cannot survive like this. Just taking damage continually is ridiculous. Not this again. Getting stunned all the time. Using all of my advanced med packs. Come on. Oh, what the oh, stunned again. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. She's taking a lot of damage. Uh, she's doing well. But we just can't kill this guy. He's so tough. He's so ridiculously tough. What do these flash mines do anyway? I've never used them before. I wonder what they do. Yes. Oh, oh. <laughs> Mine laid and ready. Is he gonna run into it or? Oh, get it. No, hasn't uh, hasn't run into it. Maybe he's not going to. I'm not sure. Uh, I need another med pack just to survive. Oh. Oh. Yes, we've taken him down. Uh, the third one didn't actually engage, uh, which is kind of cool, but uh, Jolly's not going to survive long against this guy um, unless we do something. So let's do a med pack and then attack. Uh, Jolie is going to have to try and survive as best as he can. Med pack and he's out of force power. And, oh, what the hell was that? What the hell was that? Let's level up. I think this Mandalorian has actually got force powers as well. Um, he's got one skill point. Uh, I guess. Hmm. Let's give it to security. Oh, okay. Uh, computer use, just in case. Uh, powers. He's pretty good with the old powers, though. Uh, Jolie. He is a Jedi consular. Um, we do have this. What is this one? Character level 18. Okay, he's a fair way away from that. On all hostile creatures within 10 meters of a target enemy. How far is this? Or in front. 16 meters in front of the Jedi. And this one is uh, within 10 meters of a target enemy. Okay, so it's a little bit different there. Uh, we've got the Force Push. There is the Force Whirlwind as well. Uh, can we do that? Okay, we've got Force Whirlwind. We'll accept that and hopefully He can start using that. Uh, let's try it. Let's try out the Force Whirlwind Jazra is Using a med pack right now hmm? Oh, there we oh. Oh. Come on, come on Jazra, come on. Not this again. Come on, come on. We can win this fight, we can. We can win this fight, we can. Uh, okay, the Force Whirlwind didn't work at all. Uh, and now he's out of he's out of power, so we can't do really much about it. There's nothing we can do about it. Um, let's keep using the Flurry. What? Oh no, not again, not again. Oh! Now you'll get it. Come on, come on. No, I can't let Jazra fall. Otherwise, we're going to lose this battle. Jolly definitely cannot do it by himself. Um, oh, my God. Bastila. Oh. Okay, there we go. We're healed up a little bit now. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, come on. Yes, one more. One more oh. hit and we're done. Not this again! Come on, come on. Never too old for this! Yes, we did it. I can't believe we we won that battle. That was amazing. Those guys were so tough. They were so tough. They better have some good equipment on them as well. Mandalorian assault rifle. Let's grab that. Uh, so that's one of them. Uh, where's Bastila? She... Frag mine. Okay. Didn't really work. The frag mine didn't really work. Recover. Might as well recover it. Uh, there we 
go. Let's have a look at these remains here as well. Uh, Mandalorian data pad. Let's grab that. And is there another data pad over here as well? Okay, Mandalorian Ripper. Okay, so they've definitely got some interesting items. Let's go and have a look. Um, definitely something I can give to uh, to one or two of my characters here. The Mandalorian Ripper. Um, doesn't do a lot of damage. It sounds pretty cool, but... Ooh, okay, ignores most personal energy shields. So, so that is pretty cool. Um, disruptor rifle, there was... Is it, was there a repeating rifle as well that they had? I'm not sure. Anyway, we have the Mandalorian data pad here. This request is in the Mandalorian language. A stump disabled the stabilizers on my swoop. I request pass before other systems fail. If the generator goes, my blending field will stop working and I'll be visible to our prey. Okay, they have some kind of invisibility field. Uh, this is a personal log in the Mandalorian language. This hunt is no challenge. How will attacking unarmed creatures train us to use these Jedi toys? You want new warriors to learn watching a comrade lop his own armor fighting a real opponent would teach more than these pointless battles. I obey Mandalore, but with protest. The blending field generators on the swoops grant near-perfect camouflage. Why only attack unarmed opponents? Okay, so they have been um, supposed to be out here practicing against just the regular prey, but uh, they're obviously laying in wait for these other uh, people to come by as well. There's a computer over there. Just want to have a quick look over here to the west and see if there is anything else on this side. It doesn't look like there is. So I guess this is going to be where the star map is located. Uh, I can't see anywhere else where it would be. Aha! We have the computer here. Be oh my god, what the heck was that? There must have been a mine there that we didn't spot. Uh, let's heal up, because we have taken a fair bit of damage. That was a really tough battle. And uh, we did really well getting through, actually. So let's jolly uh, heal up everyone as yes. well. Now, Jezra has pretty good computer use. Uh, let's save the game before we attempt to find the, uh, the star map. Uh, okay. Yes. Life forms detected. Determining parameters. Initiating neural recognition. Yes, there's the thing. Obstinate machine. I have no doubt it holds what you seek. But good luck getting it operational. Primary neural recognition complete. Preliminary match found. Match found? What the... It always muttered something about rejected patterns for me. Begin socialized interface. Awaiting instruction. Greetings. This terminal has not been accessed for quite some time. Uh, what is your purpose? Error. Subject displays unfamiliarity to environment. Behavioral reconfiguration will be needed before access. I am sorry. I did not mean to confuse you. I will answer questions to the best of my programming limitations. What do you mean by behavioral reconfiguration? I have been programmed with a very limited field of knowledge, and I must restrict access to only those that fit my allowed pattern. Okay, I seek information about a star map. Accessing? Yes, I have found a star map in original system memory. Access is restricted. Uh, original system memory, so the map is as old as this installation. Error. Data regarding author of the star map is corrupted. What do I need to do to get access to the star map? Your request requires additional security access. You must be made to match the parameters I have been supplied. Okay, how can I match them when I don't know what they are? There are measures available. Personality profiling will verify the basic structure of your conscious mind. With that, I will determine whether you are ready to receive the star map, or can be made ready. Okay, uh, hmm. What if I... F what do you mean by that? What if I fail? I don't want to ask about failing. Information unavailable. If you have further questions, ask them now. Access will terminate with success or failure of evaluation. Oh god, alright. Uh, 
you may begin evaluation. Evaluation commences. <laughs> Results will be compared against the pattern in memory. Just act like you should. I'll you try. travel with a Wookiee and have encountered complications. Hypothetical. You and this Zalbar are captured and separated. If you both remain silent, one year in prison for each of you. However, call Zalbar a traitor and he will serve five years while you serve none. He is offered the same deal. But if you both accuse the other, you both serve two years. What do you do? What do you trust him to do? Okay. I trust Zalbar. I say nothing and neither would he. Um, okay, I'm not sure what Zalbar would say. I would accuse him to be safe. Okay, I trust Zalbar. I would say nothing and neither would he. Are you sure? If you turn, you risk two years. Or none at all. If you reply on loyalty, you risk one year. Or five. Your loyalty is dangerous. Your companion could take the opportunity to benefit by turning on you. Zalbar's family is mired in treachery. What loyalty do they know? Your answer is incorrect. What? Choice is mine, I refuse to alter. You cannot refuse. Evaluation must continue. You must match the pattern in memory. Your memory. I must demand honest acceptance of the proper behavior. That is a condition of my programming. So he's comparing the pattern in my mind against my answers. My answers against the pattern in my memory. Um, okay, continue with your evaluation. The previous incorrect response will be discounted. Future incorrect responses will result in rejection. Hypothetical. You are at war, deciphering an intercepted code. You learn two things about your enemy. A single spot in their defense will be at its weakest in ten days, and they will attack one of your cities in five days. What do you do with this information? What is the most efficient course of action? Ha ha ha. What was that? What was that? <laughs> Hypothetical. You are at war, deciphering an intercepted code. You learn two things about your enemy. A single spot in their defense will be at its weakest in ten days, and they will attack one of your cities in five days. Oh gosh. What do you do with this okay. information? What is the most efficient course of action? Okay, so they're going to attack in the city in five days. Uh, they're going to be at their weakest in ten days. So we can, I guess we can sacrifice the city uh, to attack them in ten days. Um, I would say evacuate, suddenly reinforce the city while preparing to attack. This is distasteful, I'll just take you apart to get the star map. I'm not sure if I can do that. Uh, evacuate people from the city, I think. Reinforce the city and prepare to attack. This is no decision. I ask again. Do you save your people or abandon them for the sake of the war? What? Attempting both will merely dilute your efforts. Would you trade one victory for two failures? Um, if they're going to attack the city, I would, would evacuate. And in so doing, alert the enemy to their broken codes. They would know that their weakness was exposed. They would reinforce, and the war would go on. You save thousands at the expense of victory. You do not match the pattern in memory. Subject has failed to demonstrate the required behavior. Access denied. This system will hurt the subject as false. Defense mode initiated. Oh, great. Okay, we're gonna have to take out these defense droids then. Uh, this guy's an idiot. Yeah, this guy's an idiot. Um, yeah. I, uh, yeah. Anyway. Anyway, we're going to take him down. I think we can tear this thing apart. <laughs> Hopefully, that's what I want to do right now. Uh, what is this thing over here? Is that attack? I hope that's attack. Uh, we've got two droids uh, we need to take out. Uh, we should have a stun droid with us. Um, let's let's see if we can take these things down um, and get to this star map. Okay, disable droid. Uh, hmm. Okay, disable droid. Hopefully, that's going to work. Uh, we have stun droid, force push. Uh, let's try a disable droid over here. I don't know how effective this is going to be. Uh, let's try stun droid. What can I do? Now that must be hurt. Okay. I think these guys are going to be pretty easy to take out. Uh, let's stun this droid as well. Disable this droid. Um, and then we'll finish taking out this one over here. Okay. <laughs> Oh, she keeps. She keeps being. Uh, Bastila keeps being frozen in uh, in ice here. Um, okay, this defense droid is. Is it dead? Not yet. It's lost its shield. 
Okay. Uh, we need to disable this droid, hopefully take out the, the shielding. Uh, we don't need you to heal up, actually. Not not just yet. Our Bastila definitely needs to heal up. What yes. can I do? Hmm. Okay, so hopefully we can find a way in to grab that star map. Uh, this little statue computer was trying to get us to force us to, to make a decision about sacrificing an entire city and uh, I didn't feel that that was the right option. I guess I could have lied, but I didn't know what he was asking for. I thought maybe they were good guys or not. Um, well, I didn't know whether they were good guys or not, so I wasn't sure. Anyway, there is something here as well. This star map is sealed and cannot be opened. How the heck am I supposed to get in here? Uh, there must be another way. There must be another way. Let's have a chat with this guy again. Neural scan complete. Analyzing, well, it would appear initial assumptions about you were incorrect. Secondary scans during battle have revealed much. Under duress, your emotions were easier to read. Programming now instructs that I give you what you seek. What did your scan during the battle reveal? That information is not available. Soon you will recognize the proper course to follow. The star map is yours. This unit has now completed its primary duty and has finished with the subject. Executing final action. Activation of star map commencing. Parameters reset. Stasis initiated. And communication. Beautiful, okay. Journal entry added, experience points received, 2800 items received, beautiful, we have... Well, a... well, a star map. An ancient artifact of dark side power. Can't say I'm surprised. I always knew there was something funny down here. I wonder if the star map has had an effect on the evolution of the creatures here in the Shadowlands. It might explain why it's so dangerous down here. An interesting theory, but I suppose we don't have time to test it now, do we? Now that we've got what you came for, we should be heading back up to the treetops. Okay, beautiful. We have uh, received the star map. Let's have a look. Uh, pretty amazing. And uh, I think we, we have finished down here in the lower Shadowlands. We're going to go back to Freya, uh, give him the blade, and then head back up to the treetops to finish uh, just the little side quest that we need to complete. Uh, before we move on to the next planet, I hope you are enjoying this playthrough. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all again soon for the next episode of uh, Knights of the Old Republic.